Hi friends, welcome back for story time. Today I will be reading Come On Rain. Here we see a little girl on the cover with her hand out, like maybe she's waiting for the rain to come. The story was written by Karen Hesse, and the pictures we'll see in the book are drawn by John J. Muth. Come on, rain, I say, squinting into the endless heat. Mama lifts a listless vine in size. Three weeks and not a drop, she says, sagging over her parched plants. The sound of a heavy truck rumbles past. Uneasy, Mama looks over to me. Is that thunder, Tessie? she asks. Mama hates thunder. I climb up the steps for a better look. It's just a truck, Mama, I say. I am sizzling like a hot potato. I ask Mama, may I put on my bathing suit? Absolutely not, Mama says, frowning under her straw hat. You'll burn all day out in this sun. Up and down the block, cats pant. Heat wavers off tar patches in the broiling alleyway. Miss Grace and Miss Vera bend, tending to beds of drooping lupines. Not a sign of my friends, Liz or Rosemary. Not a peep from my pal, Jackie Joyce. I stare out over rooftops, past chimneys, into the way off distance. And that's when I see it coming. Clouds rolling in. Gray clouds bunched and bulging under a purple sky. A creeper of hope circles round my bones. Come on, rain, I whisper. Quietly, while Mama weeds, I cross the crackling dry path past Miss Glick's window. Glancing inside as I hurry by, Miss Glick's needle sticks on her phonograph, playing the same notes over and over in the dim, stuffy cave of her room. The smell of hot tar and garbage bullies the air as I climb the steps to Jackie Joyce's porch. Jackie Joyce, I breathe, pressing my nose against her screen. Jackie Joyce comes to the door. Her long legs, like two brown string beans, sprout from her shorts. It's going to rain, I whisper. Put on your suit and come straight over. Slick with sweat, I run back home and slip up the steps past Mama. She is nearly senseless in the sizzling heat, kneeling over the hot rump of a melon. In the kitchen, I pour iced tea to the top of a tall glass. I aim a spoonful of sugar into my mouth, then a second into the drink. Got you some tea, Mama, I say, pulling her inside the house. Mama sinks onto a kitchen chair and sweeps off her hat. Sweat trickles down her neck and wets the front of her dress and under her arms. Mama presses the ice-chilled glass against her skin. Aren't you something, Tessie, she says. I nod smartly. Rain's coming, Mama, I say. Mama turns to the window and sniffs. It's about time, she murmurs. Jackie Joyce in her bathing suit knocks at the door and I let her in. Jackie Joyce has her suit on, Mama, I say. May I wear mine too? I hold my breath waiting. A breeze blows the thin curtains into the kitchen, then sucks them back against the screen again. Is there thunder, Mama asks. No thunder, I say. Is there lightning, Mama asks. No lightning, Jackie Joyce says. You stay where I can find you, Mama says. We will, I say. 
Go on then, Mama says, lifting the glass to her lips to take a sip. Come on, Rain, I cheer, peeling out of my clothes and into my suit while Jackie Joyce runs to get Liz and Rosemary. We meet in the alleyway. All the insects have gone still. Trees sway under a swollen sky. The wind grows bold and bolder. And just like that, rain comes. The first drops plop down big, making dust dance all around us. Then a deeper gray descends and the air cools and the clouds burst and suddenly rain is everywhere. Come on, rain, we shout. It streams through our hair and down our backs. It freckles our feet, glazes our toes. We turn in circles, glistening in our rain skin. Our mouths wide, we gulp down rain. Jackie Joyce chases Rosemary, who chases Liz, who chases me. Wet, slicking our arms and legs, we splash up the block, squealing and whooping in the streaming rain. We make such a racket, Miss Glick rushes out on her porch. Miss Grace and Miss Vera come next, and then comes Mama. They run from their kitchens and skid to a stop. Leaning over their rails, they turn to each other. A smile spreads from porch to porch, and with a wordless nod. First one, then all. Fling off their shoes, skim off their hose, tossing streamers of stockings over their shoulders. Our bare-legged mamas dance down the steps and join us in the fresh, clean rain. While the music from Miss Glick's phonograph shimmies and sparkles and streaks like li night lightning. Jackie Joyce, Liz, Rosemary, and I, we grab the hands of our mamas. We twirl and sway them, tromping through puddles, romping and reeling in the moisty green air. We swing our wet and wild hair, mamas, till we're all laughing under trinkets of silver rain. I hug Mama hard and she hugs me back. The rain has made us new. As the clouds move off, I trace the drips on Mama's face. Everywhere, everyone, everything is misty limbs springing back to life. We sure did get a soaking, Mama, I say. And we head home purely soothed, fresh as dew turning toward the first sweet rays of the sun. And that is the end of Come On Rain. That was a really great story. I love when the rain comes in the springtime because it gives the chance for the plants and gardens to get the water that they need so they can grow beautiful flowers and wonderful crops. Is there something that you like to do in the rain on rainy days? If so, maybe you can share with someone in your home. Well, that's all I have for today, friends. Thank you for listening. Goodbye. <laughs>